Uh, hello everybody, Cyanesk111 here, and welcome back to more Civilization VI, Gathering Storm. Uh, I've done quite a lot over the course of the last two parts. And I finally settled down here, near Gibberish Volcano. And I'm finally exploring down here. I wonder if I may be able to settle down here for more resources. I don't know if I'll need them, but it wouldn't hurt to try. I've gotten rid of another barbarian encampment down here, and there's another one here that I want to take care of. And another one. Uh, now that I think about that, the one thing that I like about the Socone is that it provides me with, uh, well, it sometimes provides me with a clean slate for whenever I need to change from between a farm and a mine. Uh, of course, there is the, uh, there's the option to remove improvements, but I'll settle for that too. saying I'm doing not doing much to develop a strong culture. Uh, I'll have you know that I'm leading in the culture victory. Still. And no, I'm still not going to risk breaking the rules of my civilization. Thank you very much. And if you see the pathways here, I think that a German city got raised. When you raise a city, you're removing it from a map completely, in this game's terms. I could get another great person. What do we have this time? Titian. Why not? I don't have a an art museum yet. Uh, I can't purchase any buildings. Um Ottawa. There we go. Do I have a... Do I have a museum already? Ah, uh, yes I do. Do I have any great works in it? Ah, uh, yes I do. Ah, uh, wait, I... I haven't... Archaeological Museum. I didn't think I was going to receive any uh, artists very soon, so I just decided to go with uh, Archaeological. Oh, Tribal Village, the booth. Yeah, I took you out very easily. More gold for me, more gold for me. I was surprised that there were no barbarians guarding that encampment over here. It's kind of unusual.
The lowest is to it. I don't care what the lowest is. I'm granted a recon unit. That's it. I can use him to automate exploration. Wonder how much I can explore before I push myself to launch a satellite. Which will reveal every single tile on the map, regardless of whether I have explored it or not. I did something. Completed a trade route. That's all. Well, this is free gold in a way. Though I'm sacrificing some of my oil. Oh, I'm at, I was at my maximum stockpile. I wonder what I can use all of that oil for. I think I may want to move my completed trader over to Victoria. Yeah, you're going to go to Victoria, right here. Have to rebuild all of this down here from the floods. Goodbye, Scout. And I get a promotion, too. Oh. I'm going to take care of that, too. There might be another barbarian encampment down here. If there is, then it's going down. What am I doing? I'm still in the lead. Oh, you got to generate diplomatic favor. I'm going to send you to Ottawa. Yeah, anything to get my theater square constructed as quickly as possible. Wait, who's that? That's from Congo. Yep. My intuition was correct. There is a barbarian encampment to the south. I have an adequate amount of troops, in my opinion. Tini tropo auxesis ten senarken, iu tu lau hene kamakese. I'm trying to grow my empire in the most peaceful way possible. I'll have you know. Water and air. Ooh, another blizzard. And it's another crippling blizzard. Bye bye. Not to the encampment, but to the troops guarding the encampment. I don't have radio research, but um, I'm going for capitalism. Um, oh, I can get a builder to build over here. Yeah, let's send aid. Oh, I, I still have more envoys. Oh, just one more. Then I'm going to send it... here. Ah. 
I last checked the world climate in the last part, and I'm still a bit surprised that climate change still hasn't reached phase one. I... How am I on CO2 levels? Absolutely nothing from me. But Alexander from the Macedonian Empire? Ooh, another barbarian encampment. How many barbarian encampments are gonna be in this game? I don't know. There goes my musket men. Actually, I'm going to uh, plant some woods in case there are any civilizations out there who believe that. Well, who have a hidden leader agenda where they like civilizations who plant trees and dislike those who cut down trees. Oh, I should have had my builder rebuild that farm. That's the thought that counts. Uh, come on, just this one last bit of exploring, and there was the end. I can't produce any buildings, but at least I can get, uh, troops. That's what I'm going for. Um, can I build a dam over in here? I'm pretty sure my musket man over here is going to get annihilated. Yep. Oh wait, no? Yep, there he goes. Rip. And produce something else over in Vancouver. Um, I want another theater square district. Oh, I don't want to overlap. I'm just going to build it right here. land. That's a bonus. About the new things up here, I'm still kind of glad that the developers of this game decided to move those things over here rather than the dead center of the screen. I'm quite thankful for that. A lot. I can see a clear difference in that. And I'm producing more gold than ever.
No innovation in the past 200 years. Yeah, I don't care about those quotes. I've heard them before. Well, ones that aren't in the future era, at least. If I'm able to... If I'm able to go all the way to the future era of technologies and civics, then I am going to let you hear the quotes for those. I wonder what they'll say. Complete mystery to me. Well, not to the game developers. I'll just have to play my way to find out. I'll have to work my darnest in order to get those. Unsettled land right here, which which is going to be mine once I get all of these barbarians out of here. Thought I had more than two envoys, but I don't have a tier three government yet. this means. War with the Aztecs very soon. You're gonna pay for this dearly. No rewards for me. I have another great person, John Rockefeller. Yes, give me. Keep it coming. Troops up there for when we for when we have to protect Mexico City. I'm halfway to a golden age now. How many turns are left in this era? Ten to eleven. Uh, if I want a golden age, then I better get I better get working. down for Mexico City. But not if I can help it. Um, speaking of which, if I go to war with them for... for me if I declare a protectorate war on them, then I may have to protect my borders up here too. So I'm going to decide what to do real quick on how to 
do both. But until that happens, I'm going to have to end this part off. And it's time for me to do so anyway. Oh, that's an anti-cavalry unit. I probably shouldn't have sent my crucier up here. But I'm gonna see what happens in this next turn before I end this part off. It might be interesting. Uh, no thanks. <laughs> That's gonna be a death trap. And Mexico City is getting his butt whooped. Uh, I better do something fast. Um, I'm gonna think about how to protect Mexico City and my borders up here once I declare war on the Aztecs. Um, but until then, I have to thank you so much for watching. And I know this turn isn't finished, but um, nonetheless, I will see everyone here in the next part. Bye. Um, there we go. Oh. Well, that was unexpected. Okay, now is when I'm going to have to end this part. So, thank you so much everyone for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!